So, hi, what's your name? My name is Justin. What's yours? Justin. I'm Joaquin. Nice to Joe. meet you. Okay, nice to so meet you. So, what are you doing, Justin? Right now, we are so Justin, leveling it. You're dunning it. And now, we're going to go and try to get this thing to go into a spin cycle. A spin cycle, okay. Okay. Yeah. If it's on a smaller load, it seems it's not as bad. Okay. In that case, then, can I put some laundry in it? Yes. If you don't mind, you can, there's some laundry up there. That there is okay. I have that laundry there if you want to put it in. Let's do that just so we can make it have a Because load. in there, I also have some uh, detergent in there, too. She put a big load in there, and it was loud. And it was really loud. And then also she puts in the detergent in there, too. Okay. Justin, uh, there's the uh, detergent there. Alright, I'm not going to put detergent in because it's not going to be in long enough to so, actually wash. We're just going to get that wet and then spin it. So you're going to watch and see what happens? Yeah. Unless it's, Can you hand me the broom, that green one? Green? Yes. Alright. Trying to get everything Nice done. to meet you, Justin. It's nice to meet you. It's nice to meet you too, bud. So what are you doing? Working on Christmas Eve, huh? Yeah. Are you trying to fix a washer and see how it is? That's what we're doing, yeah. Yeah, my mom's in the hospital. She'll oh, really? She's in the hospital. Oh, that's sad. I'm sorry to hear that. She went in on Saturday. She has brain cancer. Oh, man. I'm sorry. She's been six months, so yeah. she has no what hospital? She's at regional. Regional? You're gonna try and see her over the holiday? I went and saw her last night. Oh, very good. I have, I've been, I've been going to pull up for about a month, for over a month now, I can't seem to shake it off. Oh. So I had to wear a mask, you know? Yeah, they don't want you around you. <laughs> yeah, it's tough. It's, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, it's, it's tough. It's just, she's really, she's, they told me they're gonna have her throughout Christmas, so. Yeah. That's like. Yeah, that, that's home. tough. She went in early Saturday morning. So what's that, Justin? <clears throat> this here is my tool bag. I want to sell this for. And these are some of the tools from my tool bag. We have pliers, so you your screwdrivers, 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 flashlight, and what's that thing? drill. This is actually not going to be used for this, but if there was some water stuck in there, so, I would where'd squeeze you get it out. Where'd you get your tools from? I get them from all over. A lot of them come from the internet. And a lot of them come from stores. I buy them. Yeah. The, so what are you uh, gonna do if you um, if you're gonna fix that washer though? It keeps making a lot of noise. Well, the first thing that I found when I got here is that it was off level. Yeah. So this I leveled it. This leg was way up and and it had a big rock to it. So I got rid of that first. And now what we're doing is we're filling it with water, getting those clothes nice and heavy. Yeah. We want to then put it into a high speed spin and see how the machine operates in a high speed spin with the heavy load. Yes. See if there's a problem elsewhere other than the being really off level that we already dealt with. Yes. So what are you doing right now, Justin? So right now it just filled. Now we're letting those clothes soak that water up and get nice so and wet and heavy. So why is the laundry soaking the water up? Because that's what makes the clothes heavy. And, does and that's it, what, what does it do after it makes the clothes heavy and it soaks the water in there? All right, then it would normally continue washing, but we're going to mm. stop it instead of letting it keep washing to save time, and then we're going to move right up to a spin cycle. A spin and cycle. And let it spin real fast, because that's when you. That's when I put. That's when I put my laundry in when when it when it gets dirty. So. Yeah. And there's my new dryer I got. That's a nice dryer. So that's when um, Tom was here. Tom was fixing the dryer so it don't work. So. Good. So this one, um, Mommy said I had this washer for um, how many years did she say? How many? I think she said six. Six years. But um, um, uh, last year I had my um, old washing machine with stickers. I put stickers on the washing machine, the old one. It was just kind of spinning. But I had a, um, a plier up there on the mach up there by the rack there and okay. then all of a sudden the um uh plier um dropped on the floor and then the washing machine started to break and it was making a lot of noise oh, okay. and then the guys was uh taking the old washer and then 
He took it out to his truck so it can be recycled. Oh, okay. And it can be thrown away. So that's Good. why. So that's why mommy went to Lowe's and asked the lady that she wants to get a new wash machine. She wants to call him because, um, and now I just got the new wash machine. Now it got delivered okay. from the truck. So. Did you did you get to watch them put it in? Yeah. That was probably exciting. They're so, taking it in and out. So you're just um, watching it now, and then you'll get a spin cycle. Correct. And that the clothes there seem like they're pretty well soaked with water now. So we're gonna. Move it to a spin cycle right now. We're gonna stop right now. Yeah. So you're gonna stop, and, and what else we're are you gonna, gonna do? Move it over to a spin. A rinse and spin. Yeah, but I'm gonna get rid of the rinse because we don't need that. We just want to spin and start. Start. So you think it'll work? You mean? Well. So what is, what is the washing machine doing now? Now it's draining. Is it rinsing or it's draining? It's draining right now. Do you like my house, Justin? Very nice, yeah. Yeah. You gonna be in your house for Christmas tomorrow? Yeah. Yeah, nice. So what are you watching now? Is it rinsing or is it, it draining? It's getting ready to spin. So what's it doing right now in there? Well, right now it's it's trying to balance the clothes. Balance the clothes. Yep, and it's still draining in any water that may drip out of the clothes. Yeah. So... Are you, uh, is your family all going to get together for Christmas? Yeah. That's nice. They're all coming here? Yeah, some, sometimes, yeah. Good. So, what are you, what's it doing now, though? It's getting ready to spin. When's it going to spin now or in a few minutes? In, a few in seconds? about two minutes. And then what's it do after it spins, though? Well, normally when it's done spinning, it's finished. So what does it do when it's finished, though? Then you would normally take your clothes out and put them in the dryer. Yeah, and, and then you put them in the dryer, and then you have to use that tool to fix the machine. Right? If there's something wrong with it, yes. Because in, cause of the inside, it was just um, making so much noise if you feel in the back. If you, if you open the inside, because it was making a loud noise, though. Okay. So now, what's it trying to do now? Drum? Was it the drum, Justin, or was it the drum that was making a noise, or? Well, we don't know yet. We're gonna find out. And so, as soon as we hear the noise, we'll know where it's coming from. Yeah. And it was like a high cycle or something. Okay. I think she had a pretty good size load. Okay. Well, let's see what happens here. So what happens? So Justin, how, what, what happens now? In about one minute, it's going to start to spin. In about one minute, it's going to. So now, what's, what did it do now? It just turned off your drain pump. So it turned off the drain and pump. And now it's going to start to spin as soon as the control says it's ready. So is it is it spinning fast or is it slow now? Uh, right now it's very slow. It's going to slowly work its way up to fast. So what are you going to do with that toolbox, though? Well, if there's a problem, we will take the machine apart with those How are we going to take the machine apart, though? Do you know well, how to do it? Oh, yes. 
Yep, I've done it many times. So how do you take the machine apart, though? Do you know how to take it apart? Yeah, it all so, depends on where you would have to go. So do you just pull it out, or how do you take it apart, though? A lot of this one gets taken apart from the back. From the so back there? Or, or, back is it there or is it the plug point over there? Or there's a plug over there that plugged in? Yeah, it's, it's not so much from the plug area. You can take the top off of this one. You yeah, can take, you can the, take back the top off. off or... Yeah. Yeah. Depends on where we need to go. Once we hear the noise, we'll decide where it seems like it's coming from, and that'll tell us where to go. Yeah. So what's it doing right now? Is it waiting or is it going slow? It's the control is making sure that the machine is ready to go into a spin cycle and it's just about ready to start. So what's it doing now, Justin? It's still on that very slow spin, getting ready to go into the high spin. So what's it doing now, Justin? This is still considered a slow spin, and it's gonna work up to a medium spin right now. Here it goes. So, well, so now what's happened? Now in a medium spin, it turns so the pump back on. To so make now sure the it gets pump is back on with yep. some water. So does it just uh, spin or does it rinse with water though? Well, the rinse would have been done by now. It'll, it'll rinse and then goes into the spin. So now this is the end. This is when So we're is the this spin. the end of it though? We're pretty close. Yeah, we got about five or six minutes of spinning to do here. And then it would be done. Mm. So Justin, you have a washing machine like this, like mine, like this, or you have a different one at home? It's pretty similar. Yeah, the one I have is pretty similar. So where is that? Is it in your kitchen at home or in the laundry room? Um, I have a laundry room it's in, yes. So do you have the same one like this or you have a, or, or you have a different kind? It's very similar to this one. Mine is also one you'll look from the front like this, but... A little bit different. So do you just put your laundry in like this how I do or yep. do you just open it or put it from the top? No, from the front, just like you do. Mm. So now what's it doing now, Justin? Still in that medium spin. So that's the medium spin. Trying to make sure it gets the water out of your clothes, yeah. Water out of the clothes. So Justin, you have a uh, truck outside or you have a car that you can? I have a van. A van? Yeah, that, that's what carries my tools and parts that I can take to houses. So now what's it doing, the washing machine? We're still in that medium spin. So when's it gonna spin fast? Mm, pretty soon. Pretty soon. Then you take the clothes laundry out and put them in the dryer, then you start the dryer and then you use the tool to see what's the problem. Right. 
Uh, so what happened now? Now it's starting to ramp to up So is it loud or is it fast? It's starting to go faster now, yeah. Oh, no, what's it doing now, Justin? Well, now it's going to slow down and rebalance the clothes now that it spun some water out of them. Spun some water out of it. And then it's going to ramp up again. Ramp up speed. again. So now what's it doing? It's just about got the clothes rebalanced. Got the clothes rebalanced. And, and now it's going to start to spin again. So is it going slow or fast? Right now it's starting to go fast. You can hear it getting faster and faster. Now I'm just going a little slow now. Mm -hmm. So now what's it doing? It's still spinning. Still spinning? Yep. Still spinning. So now what's it doing? Now it's spinning fast. Really fast. So now it's spinning really fast. Yep. So why is it spinning really fast? To get a lot of the water out of the clothes. Yep. So now what's it doing now? Is it louder or, or is it a louder spin? This is the very the fast spin. So do you have a big van, Justin? You came a big van? I have a medium sized van. A medium sized van. Yeah. So now is it spinning fast? Now how many minutes is it saying? Uh it's saying five minutes. Oh yeah, it's six minutes. No, now it's saying five minutes. Right. And then what does it do after it spins fast? Well, then it would stop and unlock the door so you could get your clothes out. And what if it makes the other, other noise, though? So now what, Justin? Now what's it doing now? Now I'm shutting it off. Now you're turning it off. Yeah, because that was the high-speed spin, and we didn't really have any noises there. That sounded pretty good. Because that sounded pretty good, Justin, yeah. isn't so it? so now I'm going to... I'm Turn gonna it stop off. it, and I'm gonna put a little more water in there to get those clothes wet again. And then, so how are you gonna get them wet again? I'm gonna move it over to a wash cycle, and we're gonna get some water in there. And then what do you do after you get some water in there? Then I'm gonna move it over. Then you're to gonna a move it over to a maximum. That'll be even a little faster than your high speed spin. Hmm. And then, are you going to see what the problem is? And then we're going to see if there's a problem, yep. When are you going to see when there's a problem? Once we hear the noise, if, there's that, if it makes the noise. So what's it doing now, though? Now it's putting water on the clothes. 
And then what does it do? Does it uh, spin or, or does it get louder though? Then it would normally go into a wash, but we're going to move it to a spin again. But we're going to let the clothes get nice and wet first. Nice and wet first. See, now you hear the water and then the water there and water in there? Yep. yep. And all the clothes in there? Mm-hmm. So how long have you lived here? Well, for a verb, um, I think for a long time, I think. Yeah. Maybe. Do you like it here? Mm-hmm. Nice spot? A nice spot here, yes. Good. So now it's uh, draining your clothes and... Right now it's starting to tumble the clothes in the water to make sure they all have water on them. Hmm. So Justin, do you know I play music or... I'm sorry, what's that? You know I play music. You play music? Yeah. Oh, yeah? So I play uh, full piano and guitar. Oh, very nice. So do you play any instruments, Justin, or no? I can play a little bit of a guitar. A little bit of a guitar. And uh, I can play a little bit of the piano. Yeah. But when did you used to start playing the guitar or the piano? Uh, I, I took lessons when I was a kid. Yeah, when? Um, when? Yeah. Uh, Probably uh, when I was like six. Probably if you, when you were and six. And I or... played piano. I took lessons till I was like maybe eighteen. Eighteen-ish. Yeah, and uh, and I continue to play, so yeah. a little bit here and there. A little bit here and then. Yeah. I like uh, I like instruments and I like to play. I have a in my basement. I have a a guitar and a drum set and piano and that and mm -hmm. sometimes when my friends get together we'll play play around with them a little bit mm -hmm. none of us are very good but we just like to, to play around with it yeah so uh, when did you start playing well actually I go to Marywood University okay. I just started going to Marywood actually I went to Marywood University twice one in January one in September okay so I started uh, going to Maryland. I started playing music in January. I started going to Maryland University in January, and then I had a, a dress rehearsal and a concert in April. And then I finished, and then I had a party in the um, at Maryland. Then I then I then I finished with the Maryland Maryland music, uh, and then I took a break for a while, and then I started to coming back, okay. and then I went back again to Maryland for the second quarter. Okay. And then good. pretty soon, Kamali figured that out because I'm going back to Marywood in January, um, the end of January. Oh, nice. So it's going to be my third semester. Very good. So now you stop the washing yep. now. So now what are you doing? Now we're going to go back to that spin. Back to the but spin. But we're going to do the maximum speed spin this time. And then what do you do after the maximum spin? We turn the rinse off and hit start. Start. So what are so you, what are you going to, to Marywood University for? What's your major? Well, it's a, it's a music program uh, called Tutti Ensembles for Special Needs Children. Cause I, I'm part of the music uh, Special Needs Music Group. That's amazing. That's really good. So. I imagine you probably enjoy that a lot, right? It's a good time. Yeah. So now what are you doing? Now uh, right now we're letting, letting it drain the water and get ready to start that maximum spin. Yep. Is there how many people uh, play in the, in the in there with you when you do your concerts and that? Um, a lot of people. It's a lot. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of people does. So now what's it doing? Doing the rim cycle? It's or? draining and it's starting to balance the clothes. So what do you do after the maximum spin? Well, if it does not make this noise in the maximum spin then we're going to think that maybe your only problem was the fact that it was really off balance, really off level. So, but if it does make so the noise... So when are you going to use off, your tools, uh, Justin? Or? Well, we had to use... What you had to use so these. Far? So what's that called? These are your, the pliers, or we call them channel locks. Yes. Because when I tipped the machine up, I had to use those to turn And then you just the take lid. it apart, or are you going to take it apart, or...? We may have to, we may not. We're going to see after we go into the maximum spin 
if it makes the noise or not. If yeah. it makes the noise, then yes, we will have to take it apart. If it does not make the noise, then the only problem that we saw was that it was really off balance. So off that balance. may be the issue. So that'll be an issue, isn't it? It may. We'll see. But it's going to take a couple minutes for us to find that out. Yeah. So when you uh, did your concert, what uh, did you play in the concert? Yeah, I was playing in the concert. Yeah. And what, what instrument did you play for the concert? Uh, last time, for the first, uh, first one last time, I played the flute at my concert. And then when I was at my concert again for the second quarter, I play piano. Oh, very nice. So you got to play two different instruments in the concert. Yeah, and now at home I'm playing uh, piano and guitar now at home. And now I'm having uh, three friends from Tootie come to my house, Catherine, Megan, and Taylor. Okay. So now what's it doing? It only has seven minutes left. Yep, it is balancing the clothes. So after it balances, then you switch it to the dryer and... If it, if it completes a spin cycle and your clothes are done, then you would take them out and put them in your dryer, yes. Yeah. To get them completely dry. And then you're gonna use those tools and... You're gonna use those tools or...? It, possibly, yeah. Possibly. If it makes a noise, then yes, we'll have to take it apart. Yeah. yeah. So how are you taking that apart if it makes the noise, though? If it makes the noise... So do you just stop it if it makes the noise, or...? If it makes the noise, depending on what noise it makes, I, I may stop it immediately. Yeah, we don't yeah. want it to do any damage in there if there is something going on. Yeah. So now what's it doing? Waiting or is it going slow? Um, this is the part of the cycle where it is getting ready to spin and the computer is making sure that everything is okay before it goes into the spin cycle. So yeah, it's trying to balance the clothes, check the clothes to make sure that the water is out of them as best it can. And it's going to then say it's ready to spin. It's going to check the door lock, make sure that it's locked and ready to go. So then what happens then if they check if if they checks the doorknob and make sure everything is locked and it's ready to spin and Right. And if it does that, it takes a couple minutes to do that and then once it's ready and it knows everything is good, then it'll start to spin. Yeah, what if it starts to spin a loud noise and then you just take the machine apart? Yeah. Yeah, we we very likely will be taking it apart. So do you just pull it on like that, or? Well, you gotta take some screws out first. So you, what do you use to take the screws out? Well, there's different kinds of screws. So this is a, this is a so drill. So what is that? Is it loud drill, or is it not loud? Well, let me turn it on for you. See, is it loud or no? I would say that's pretty quiet. That's it's pretty not quiet. Very loud. It's not very loud. No. So that's a drill, so what does no. that do? Well, this one I use to take out Right now, this has got a Phillips bit in it. This is a Phillips bit. And, and then that that's a out. screwdriver. Yep, and that takes and that's out a wrench. Bit. This is a channel locks or pliers. This is a screwdriver. This screwdriver here has lots of different screwdrivers in it. Because you have this one, but you can pull it out and turn it. And then it has a different size bit. And I think it's getting ready to... Yes, it is. And then in March, uh, Justin, I'm going to a uh, competition. Are you? Yeah, I'm going to Hershey in March. Oh, Because wow. last year I've been going to cheer competitions. Like, I've been going to Trenton, another Trenton in Philadelphia for competition. Okay. And um, doing a lot of my activities, Justin. I'm doing swimming, riding music, uh, horseback riding, and cheerleading, and mom dancing and ballet, and everything. Wow, you do a lot of stuff. And I play music, I play flute, piano, guitar, everything. That's amazing. So now, um, now what's it doing? Well, now that it's been, 
it's completed balancing the clothes. Now the drain pump is turned back on because some of the water has dripped out of the clothes. So it's going to do that and it's going to still try and balance the clothes for a little while and then it's going to go into the spin. Yeah. Pretty soon. Pretty soon. So now what's it doing? Uh, going slow or is it rinsing? It's going very slow right now. Making sure that the clothes are all even around the drum. Yep. So Justin, you have to take those tools and fix something different or? I use those to fix a lot of different machines, yeah. Like what? Washers, dryers, Washers, ranges, dryers. refrigerators. What about vacuum if it's a... I don't actually fix vacuum cleaners. There's not too many vacuum cleaners that people fix. But do you fix. have a vacuum at home or? Um, yes. Yeah, I, have a, I have a couple vacuums because some vacuums work better for different things. But I have like a have little one. On it or? I'm sorry? Hoses on it? Um, I have a vacuum that is in my wall that I just carry the hose and plug it into the wall. So that one has a big hose, yeah. Yeah, that's when all the washer is um, rinsing or waiting. It is still getting ready to spin, yep. And when's it going to spin, Justin? Um, probably in about two or three minutes. It takes a little while for that control to really... And when you do really after it spins, Justin, do you just turn it on or you turn it off then? Well, once it gets done spinning, um, if it makes the noise, we'll take it apart to see where it's making the noise from. Yeah. Or do you just move the washer and just take it apart like that? Well, I can take some of it apart right where it is, but a lot of it I have to move it to take apart. So yeah. if we have to get to the back of it, we'll have to pull it away from the wall so we have room or to work Or do you need just leave, put, leave the plug on it or take the plug off? Sometimes I'll leave the plug on. Sometimes I need to unplug it because you don't want to touch anything inside the machine that could shock you if you leave it plugged in. So sometimes we have to unplug it, yes. Yeah, but why do you need to unplug it though, Justin? Well, we why? would need to unplug it if we don't want to get shocked. Or get hurt, you mean? Or get hurt from the shock, yeah, because electricity can hurt you if you touch the wire that has yeah. electricity on it, yeah. Especially it has the prongs on it, though. It has the three plugs, the prongs on it. Yeah. Yeah, and I don't want to get shocked wall. or get hurt. But right. <clears throat> and then, then if you take the laundry, I'll switch it to the dryer. Then you just have to fix the inside and see what problem it is in there. Yeah, we want to make sure it's all working properly. So it has to make sure that if it's working properly. That's right. So now what's it doing? Um, going or is it going slow now? It's... Going slow, it's just about ready to start the spin. Pretty soon. Pretty soon. Takes a long time. So now what's it doing? Starting to spin. Is it spinning faster or is it going to spin? This is medium. Medium hot. Medium spin, right? Yep. And now what's it doing? Now it's going to slow down and it's going to redistribute or rebalance the clothes again. Yeah. <coughs> so now what's it doing? This is where it rebalances and redistributes the clothes. Yeah. Slows down to do that. 
So you said you have some friends coming over? Yeah, I, actually my mom said, actually I, I had uh, three friends coming over from Tootie, um, Catherine, Megan, and Taylor came. Okay. To give me, le to give me lessons. Nice. Uh, they gave me lessons on the guitar and the piano. Okay. The, the guitar and the piano. So now what's it doing? What's the washing machine doing right now? Now it's just about to the point where it's got the clothes redistributed and rebalanced. And it's now getting ready to go and ramp up into the high maximum speed spin. Yeah. So now what's it doing? What's the washing machine doing now? Now it's going into the maximum high speed spin. So what is it doing for the maximum high spin? That's when it spins very, very fast. And then what happens then? Well, if it does that and it gets, completes it, then it will stop and say it's done. By when? By two minutes or one minute? Well, it'll take about four or five seems like it's so is that a wrench pretty good. That's a wrench? Yeah. So what's it do then? So now it's going a little fast. So is it going, is it fast, is it spinning faster or is it really That's long? very fast. Now that's very fast. Is yep. it tested? Isn't that very fast? Yeah, that's very fast. And it sounds pretty good. Yeah. I don't hear any noises, which is a good thing. Well, which is a very good thing. So now, so what does it do after it spins? Well, now when it, <coughs> when it gets done with this, it's the end of the cycle and the clothes are done. And then you throw them in the dryer then. Right. And then you see what the <coughs> problem is. <laughs> then, you, then you know how to set the dryer, right, Justin? Yeah, yeah, but we're not going to put these clothes in there yet because we didn't put soap on these clothes yet. So are you going to, uh, did you put soap or? No, because they weren't washing long enough to clean them. Yeah. So that's as fast as it spins and is it that, sounds pretty good. Is it sounds pretty good or is it not bad at all? Or? No, it seems like it's good. Is it working or no? It seems like it's working perfectly. Yeah. So once it hit the one minute, then it stops though, right? Yeah. So how many minutes does it stay now? Five. So it says five minutes now. And then um, do you have to look and see what the problem is that in the inside of the washer? Or? Yeah. Well, as of right now, I don't hear any problems. There's no problem. So right. what do you do now? Well, we may have fixed the issue that you were having when we leveled the unit. So what are you going to do with that tools though anyway? Well I might not need them at this point, but you probably want me to take it apart, don't you? Yeah. You want to see the inside of it? Yeah. I can do that for you. Yeah. I can show you the inside. I can come closer and see how the inside is. Yeah. So you, do you buy those tools from, um, or do you get the toolbox from a store or something? Or? Yeah. Or that was from your house? No, those I get from the store just for work. So you might have to pull it apart though. If it makes that noise, you might have to pull it apart. Yeah. 
But as we can see, it's not really making you move, it. Then if you move the wash and then you put the plug out of it. Again, yeah. And then you'll show me how it, how it, how it is. Sure. Yeah, and if you want to show me, then you can do that. So, so that's just four minutes now. So is this thing really fast or is it loud? That's very fast right now. And since it's spinning very fast and not making any noise, we're going to stop it because it's not going to spin any faster than that. Mm -hmm. And uh, we'll let that slow down. And now what is it doing? What's it doing now? Now it is slowing down so we can unlock the door. Yeah. Okay. okay. Now that it's stopped, it's going to start to unlock the door. Can I? This light tells us the door is still locked. So we have to wait for that light to stop flashing. Yes. Okay. So I think everything's working just fine. Perfectly, sir. And I think your main problem was the fact that the legs were not level to the floor. They are not level to the floor. Or right. Something. Which now they are. So now the noise should not come back. Yeah. So now that we're done with that, so now if you would it. like, I'll take the top off so you can see the inside if you want. Yeah, so I could. You want me to do that? Mm-hmm. Okay, let's let this door, it's almost unlocked. Almost unlocked. Mm-hmm. Give it a couple more seconds. That light will stop flashing when it's unlocked. It's almost done at the end. Mm -hmm. So. Almost stopping at the end. That green's almost almost done. Yep, almost unlocked the door. When's it gonna turn off the green light? Um, once the control knows that the spin is, the spin is over and that the drum has stopped turning and it's safe, then it says it'll unlock the door so you can go into it. Yeah. Oh, see? All right, so now the light went out. Yeah, now. So now we're going to be able to unlock the door like that. So you open that now, so. And then we'll pull it out a little. Pull it out. Like this. And you move the washing machine like that. Okay. And now. Now I'm going to take out two screws back here. Okay? Back here. You can come a little closer if you want. I'm going to take out that screw. Take out that screw, okay? Okay. And then to be safe, what I'm gonna do is unplug it so we don't get shocked, okay? okay so now you have to unplug it. Yeah. So I'm gonna take the plug is out. Is that from the wire or that's from the washer? This one's from the washer. So now. And then the top slides back and lifts up. So, so slide it back a little bit. Slide it back a little bit. And then lift it up. Okay. Yeah, so what do you do after you lift the top? Well, then I'm going to show you what's on the inside. Yeah. And that's what your washer looks like underneath the top. Oh, yeah. Well, what's it on top of the washer like this? Well, we've got your you got? water valve. Water valve. you got a hot, a hot. Ble a cold, and your bleach and bleach. fabric softener dispensers. And fabric softener and dispensers. Yeah. And, and then this is your... Water tank, water reservoir that the water goes into. 
It's where your soap the and detergent goes into. That's the detergent into. goes into. Yeah. This is your wire harness. Wire harness. This is your pressure sensor. Yeah. To tell how full the water goes in the tub. Or does it spin though, like the inside when you're... This is your tub that spins tub that here. spins with the this water. This is the outer tub that stays still, and then mm -hmm. the one inside there is the one that spins. So and then now, this over here is your control board. Yeah. And there's the wires that connect to your control board. Yeah. Okay. They all look good. Nice and tight. Do they look nice and tight? Yeah. And then this is an air breather hole, so air it breather. lets some air breathe. Yeah. And then back in the back, which is hard for you to see from there, is your What pulley. is in the back of the bag of the washer? There's a pulley back here with a belt that turns the drum. Does it spin or does it turn the drum? Um, well, it rotates the inner drum when it's spinning or washing, yeah. Yeah. So everything looks good. So everything looks good, Justin. Yep. So now all you need to so do is uh, put the back plug together. back on, and then you gotta put the top on. Yeah. And now you gotta see what the problem is for the inside. Right, Justin? I think you are all fixed. There's no more problems. So no more problems. Good. So how about the inside? Did you check the inside and see? I'm sorry. We don't have a problem. There's no the problem back. Yeah, Put the no more screws problems. back, no more problems. That. And now. And now we push it back to where it's supposed to be. And there's no problem at all, Justin, huh? Nope. Did you check the inside and see if there's a problem in there? And make sure it's still balanced. You need to check the door and see how the door is. Right, Justin? Mm -hmm. So you lift that. See. Back with yeah, this. Nice and tight. Very and good. The door and the... Everything looks good. Everything looks good, Justin. We're set. All set. Okay.